Hey guys, be sure to follow my new Instagram, Marspeed underscore official. It's a good place to send me questions, and it's easy to answer them all in one place. Hey guys, so I'm just doing a quick video today on my Broadway mirror. I'll be installing it and giving a quick review on it. Um, the one I have here, I can't remember which size it is. Um, I'll post that um, on the video. And it's a convex mirror, and it cost me about $20 from Amazon. So the Broadway mirrors come in both flat and convex style. So flat is just basically your more normal line of vision and your convex will be a uh, better vision on the corners and sides, but things will look smaller in the rear view. It's kind of a distortion effect that takes a little bit of getting used to. So here's a list of things that the Broadway mirror does or is supposed to do that makes it better than your normal rear view mirror. So installing it is super easy. All you do is you have these clips here that expand and they go over your normal tiny ass mirror. All right, so there it is. And you can see already how much extra space you get on both sides um, as opposed to the normal mirror, both width and length. So as for the size of the mirror, I just chose the biggest one I could find. Um, if I'm getting the biggest mirror, you know, why not go for the biggest one? Um, and obviously, the more mirror, the more you can see. So as you can see here, the, the, the view is a little distorted. Um, I don't know if you can tell on camera, but it's, it looks further back than it really is compared to the normal mirror. Um, I'll show a comparison uh, in a few minutes in the video. But again, from my positioning here, this is pretty much where you can see, or this is pretty much my line of sight. So I can see the passenger over here, and then I can see from blind spot all the way to the other blind spot. So it's pretty cool that um, you can like you can literally lane change by looking in your mirror. So you don't even have to check your blind spots. Of course, that's not safe, but I'm just saying that it's pretty cool. Um, you always can you can just see a lot more with this thing. So with the sun visors down, um, it's a little bit of a problem, as you can see here. Definitely cuts it cuts it out a little bit. So if that's a problem for you and you don't want the sun visors blocking your mirror, then definitely just get a smaller size. Um, I believe the smallest Broadway mirror would have fit perfectly in here. Um, I just don't really use these, so it doesn't matter to me. And this is the normal mirror, so I mean, you can see from the difference, it's absolute shit. You cannot see anything. Right there is my line of view right here, so I can't see, I can't see anything close to the other one. I can't, like, I can't see that which is what you saw on the other one so a lot smaller okay so I'll do just a quick little road test with the normal mirror just to show you what it normally looks like with the Broadway mirror. I'm driving around very uh, quiet streets, so no problems filming. So yeah, this is a great little $20 mod that you can add to any car. Um, I think it's really cool. Of course, your vision sight is greater. Um, you can see, especially on this one, um, from from blind spot to blind spot. And um, of course, that'll be different depending on what size you get. And you can still get flat or, uh, or convex like mine. So yeah, I just think it's a really awesome, cheap and fun little thing to do to your car. So thanks for watching. Subscribe for more. And I'll see you next video.